Okay, for real now, let's get this vlog up to date. I know I've said that for a while, but I'm also closing in on it now. I've already chopped away f at 4 this morning, I'm just letting Final Cut do its thing, because honestly, I've been using Final Cut for what? Since February? Yeah, I did my trial in February. This is the first crash I've had. So I was like, okay, I'm just going to step back and let it just do its thing. So I just just put the card back in the camera because I imported all the footage from the past four days or however long it's been since the, the last time I did the import. But yeah, five months crash free. That's a pretty good result for Final Cut because anybody who's cut on Premiere knows that it would have been an infinite number of crashes by now. I'm, I didn't even lose any work with the crash, so I'm honestly not that, uh, that annoyed. Just had to launch the program again. That was the biggest pain. And for that to be about as far as I can go, well, that's a pretty good spot. Actually, and also because it's Final Cut, it's already done exporting and I can already get back to work. Damn you, Final Cut, you're too good. I told you guys I'd somehow get caught up by the end of the month. So, the only thing not edited right now is today's. I've got, I think, two or three on the exporter. Yep, there's the last two on the exporter. I already uploaded a whole bunch. There's the release schedule that I have to do for the end of the, uh, the end of the month here, and uh, we're pretty much set. The only thing left I have to edit is today's, tomorrow's, and the one from the day after. Because that's yesterday's. I'm all caught up. Can you hear it? It's changing its own temperature. The air conditioning goes to the back. You guys are looking at one half of my glasses through the other half of my glasses. Because I really needed today to be this much of a problem that my glasses snapped in half. Thankfully, though, her has some sort of a memory. So she was able to find my old pair. So these are the pair that I got, I guess, in 2018 at some point. So they're a little bit older, but they actually still work pretty well. I actually can see a little bit sharper through these, which actually was really surprising. My vision itself is a little bit sharper, but my astigmatism correction is not as good. So they're definitely making me just a little bit dizzy. And again, part of that is, well, one, I'm, recover I'm recovering from being sick, which is exactly what I needed today. And two, um, getting used to, used to any new prescription, which in this case is an old prescription, does that. And I mean, they, they did say that when I got my, my eye exam in May of 2019, because that was the last time I did it. It's like your prescription really didn't change. It's really just your, your astigmatism correction. And then what Sarah happens to be working on right now is the other problem that we just had. If you'll notice, near the bottom corner of that, that little white thing over there, that is a mouse trap because I was literally just lying on the floor and a mouse walked up to me like, yo, what up? And I was like, are you kidding me right now? Because I extra did not need that today. But here we are. Screw it, I'm going to bed. It's not even that late. Good night.